Hi friends, welcome to my channel. This is a very very special video for all the students who are going to sit for the net exam tomorrow. I know you guys have worked really hard in order to crack this exam, in order to qualify this exam and tomorrow is going to be a big day. I'm pretty sure that at this moment you would be flooded with anxiety, tension, worriness, and you have so many questions bubbling in your head at this moment questions like how the paper would be how are you going to perform in the paper will you get it right will you qualify it this time and i'm sure that you must be looking forward for somebody who can come and answer you i cannot answer you the questions that you have in your head but yes at this moment i can give you a winning tactics i'm telling you guys that tomorrow Please go into the exam hall with a winning mindset. It's very important. Don't let what you cannot do come in the line of what you can do. Don't let what you have not done interfere with what you can do tomorrow. A head full of fear is never going to take you to your dreams, to your goals. It's very important that tomorrow when you enter into the exam hall, you tell yourself very loudly, you can do it. You can do it right now and you can do it right every time you need to tell yourself that you have the power you have the confidence to qualify net in first attempt and you're going to do it this time also please make sure that whatever you've done so far don't question yourself don't get into a negative self-talk don't tell yourself i could have prepared a little more i could have done so many questions more whatever you've done let it be there don't let it interfere don't let it pull you down it's very very important that all those lacunas that you had in your preparation let them be the stepping stone and let them take you to your goal make sure that you believe in yourself you believe that you are a miracle and you are here on this earth to do the best and God is going to give you the results that you deserve. It's not important whether you qualify or not, but what is important is that you attempt it in the best way you can. And also, I would wish you, I would like to bless you that tomorrow when you sit in the exam hall, you have a state of mind which is very calm, very composed, and very confident in its own ability. Also, there are few important tips that I would like to tell you at this moment, which you need to keep in mind tomorrow when you sit for the exam. There are other important tips which I have already mentioned in a video. The link of the video is in the I button. Please watch that video so that you can prepare yourself well on the last day so that you can sit for the exam very confidently and you do not make mistakes, which a lot of students make on the day of the exam. The first important tip that I would like to give you at this moment is that please avoid all sorts of discussions tomorrow. Make sure that you avoid anything that disturbs your mental balance. A very negative discussion with a friend of yours can cost you a lot. So make sure that you avoid all these group discussions, discussing anything with anybody who has a negative approach towards life. The second important thing that you should remember at this point is that tomorrow, please, when you sit in the exam hall, sit in the exam hall with confidence. Tell yourself when you look at the paper, you can do it and at least try to give your best. It's not about winning every time. It's about giving your best. Make sure that when you are going through the question paper, you don't focus on the lengthy questions too much. Your attempt should be to answer maximum questions in minimum time. You should remember that every question carries equal marks. So don't devote a lot of time in one question because that one question is only going to give you two marks. And the same way, an easy question is also going to give you two marks. Make sure you reach the exam hall before one hour so that you are not in hustle. Carry all the important stuff, Aadhaar card, a pen, paper, everything with you. Don't wear anything that can make you feel uncomfortable. Go in comfortable clothing. It's summertime. Don't try to look nice. It's more about comfortable body and a comfortable mind. As far as attempting paper is concerned, make sure that you read every question twice. There are times when question is designed in a manner so that you are tempted to answer it quickly. Sometimes you 
skip reading not in the question and that is why your answer becomes wrong in spite of the fact that you correctly know the answer just because you did not read the question twice you did not read the question with full concentration you end up answering wrong so make sure you look for all those traps make sure you understand the question correctly you understand the language of the question and also while you are answering a question please make sure that when you read the question you know that what are the options sometimes people are so confident about the answer that they don't read other options and they just mark one option don't do that read all the four options use the elimination technique eliminate all the options which cannot be correct and what is left would be the correct answer if you're giving any second thoughts about sitting in the exam because you did not prepare so well please don't do it right now whatever you've prepared just go and sit for the exam and i'm telling you that when you'll give the exam automatically all the things that you've not even revised is going to strike and there is a power greater than you and me who is sitting above and watching us all and he's going to definitely help you he's going to sail you through exam so pray to that power be it any name jesus allah god ram be it any name just pray to that power before you attempt your first question and also make sure that when you're answering the question please follow the online test pattern don't just mark the answer save it also because a lot of students don't save the answer and later they find out that all the answers that they have answered correctly it is not showing in the answered section so make sure you don't make that mistake apart from that another important thing i would like to tell you tomorrow when you go to the exam hall take long deep breaths whenever you find that you are in a state of anxiety you are in a state of panic don't panic take it easy it's just a phase it is going to pass away it is not going to decide your destiny it's just an exam don't create a hype so that your body turns into a state of panic just take deep long breaths whenever you feel as if you've lost touch with reality you're feeling as if you're going to um, fall down or you feel as if you're not going to answer the questions correctly just take long deep breaths and i'm telling you it is going to take your body again into a state of uh, content a state of relaxation i wish you all the best from the entire team of arpatakarva.com we are all going to pray for you tomorrow i hope you nail it this time and we wish you all the very best